I'm just a doll, Keith. Will you still love me? Who are you? What do you mean, you're a doll? Goodbye, Keith. You'll get that someday. Wait, don't go. Oh, you're hard. Is it okay? Sure. Um... What's wrong? I, I can feel it. It? Yeah. You like it? Do I? You're red like a tomato. I'm a doll, him. so basically, it's artificially red. That makes you even cuter. Can I kiss you? Will you kiss me? Okay. So it was just a dream. Again. Another wet dream. And another fucking school day. Ugh, I just hope the graduation comes soon. So I can leave the damn out of this H3 all. Brother, are you awake? Nope. Time to wake up. Mom and Dad are fighting. Again? Yes. Please do something, brother. Why would I have to bother? What do you mean? That's our parents. Leave them be. It's better for them to divorce anyway. No, you don't understand. If they get separated, Mom will bring me to NYC with her. I'll never see you again, Keith. I'm not surprised. Ugh. I knew counting on you was a bad idea. Then why were you still doing that? You are hopeless, brother. Clara, pack your things. We're moving out. The fick you are? Clara is staying with me. Keith, you go with her. Uh, I'm not going with that brat. That's what I thought. Please don't say that, Mom. My brother is not a brat. Thanks for reminding me again, little sis. Ugh, I don't care. Clara, please go with Mommy. We'll move to NYC, so you can study art. Clara, darling, your mom is broke. You can have anything you want, if you stay with me. Say something, my little princess. Please don't put me into this situation. You're my parents. I don't want to choose. Keith, please help. Dad? Mom? What? what? I'm going to school. You're crying. No, I'm not. Your eyes are red? No, they aren't. I know you feel lonely today. Ugh, that's not true. You look like you don't care. But inside you're crying like a little boy. Do not wander around and say such thing. Who are you anyway? My name is Barbie. Barbie? Isn't it the name of a toy for girls? I guess. But I'm different. My whole life was made. For you. Huh? You will find me in your arms. What was that supposed to mean? Goodbye again. Keith. On that day, I please hug me tight. What was that supposed to mean? Good. You can sit next to Keith. Huh? All right, class. Let's turn to page 69 and learn about the history of being gay. Hey. Um, who are you? Hello. You're funny. What do you mean? I was just standing in front of the class and introducing myself. I'm the new student here. Oh, sorry. I was napping back then. Lol, still you volunteered to let me sit next to you. Sleep talking, actually. I see. Hey, what the fick, dude? Sorry, I thought we were having some chemistry. I'm not gay, dude. Oh. This is so embarrassing. I'm leaving now. Hey, wait. Fuck this school. I'm going home. Wait, I'm sorry. I don't mean it. I swear. Then prove it. Huh? Um. You feel anything? Feels so good. Then you meant it. So long, new gay boy. <laughs> There's no one. Old man probably has gone to the bar with his chicks. Clara must have left for NYC with the old lady. This box is from her. Oh, my little sis. Why the flip did you put everything on my bed? Uh, yeah. 
What's that sound? Clara's doll. It's warm. And soft. I wonder if it feels nice to hug it. While sleeping. Barbie. Barbie, is that you? Oh, good morning, Keith. Barbie. Keith, you're hard again. Oh, sorry. No, don't say that. Then you like it? I may... You're finally here. Are you happy? I'm so happy. I want to kiss you so bad. Then kiss me now. Kiss me more. Wait, we should stop. Why? You know I'm a doll, right? Yeah. That means I don't have that thing. That thing? That, that... That what? That tiny hole. Oh. Yep, that thing. I don't mind. Really? You still have a mouth. What does that... Oh. Yep, that, that... Okay, kiss me again. You sure? Uh, I told you. I was made. All for you. You look so pretty. Like a real soft boy. Yeah? I'm not lying. And... Your lips are soft. Like the clouds on heaven. You want to go up high for it? Yes. Show this daddy devil how heaven would look like. It's better now. Do you want to do it again? Okay. Damn. And hear the school day again. Oh. I can stay at home if you want. No, just go, Vidi. I can wait. Are you sure? What is going on? I can explain. No need. I don't mind your gay things here, because you're not my son anyway. Good morning, Mr. Wilson. It's my honor to see you again. Again? Have we met before? Yes. Actually, we meet every single day. Sorry. I don't recall anything about you. It's a long story. I really love your mustache. Huh? Even my ex-wife has never said that to me. Okay, Barbie. Come with me. No, young boy. You'll stay. I've got to go to school. I'm not talking about you, little brat. I'm talking about Pinky Boy. You should go. But Barbie... Go. Don't worry about me. But... Just go. Fine. I'll be right back soon. Or not. Shut up, old man. Sup? Sup. Yo! I heard you kissed a boy. What? No. You can't lie to us. Dan saw you and Elio kiss outside the class yesterday. Busted. The new boy? Yeah, he likes me. So what? He likes you so you kissed him back? Are you for real? I'm losing my brain cells. Just ignore it. It's a long story. Hey, that's Elio. He's coming at us. All right, we'll leave you some privacy. Chia. Wait, and there they've gone. Keith? I'm not in the mood right now. Chit-chatting later? Just hear me out. I've been thinking a lot about yesterday. I just want to apologize to you. Okay. Will it be fine if we become friends? I don't think so. Oh. Um, where are you going? To the toilet. Want to join? Okay. I was being sarcastic, dude. Oh. Bro, what are you doing? Prove to you that we can be friends. Oh, crap. Just give me a break. Sure thing. Wait, I don't mean that. Please stop. You don't look like you hate it. Just stop. Then why don't you resist? Keith, when will you be back? I'm waiting for you. Keith, I love you. Move your ass out. Emma Flynn. Here. Tony mother a fucker. It's Tony Mulderflinker, sir. Right. Elio Harper? Elio. Keith, have you seen him today? Nope. All right, absent. I wonder how is Barbie now? What if that old man hurts him? Damn, it, I need to go home now. No, <laughs> now, Mr. Wilson. You can't just go in and out whenever you like. The school has its rules. Fick the rules. Barbie? Barbie, where are you? Hey, Brett. Why are you holding the knife with blood? What the fick, old man? Where's my Barbie? Stop screaming like a girl. 
Your princess is downstairs. Go see for yourself. Damn you, motherfucker. La 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 la. La 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 la. Barbie? Oh, Keith, I welcome home. Barbie, you're alive. Oh. What's this for? I thought you were in danger. Danger? What danger? Did that old man hurt you? You mean Mr. Wilson? No, why would he do that to me? You still think I'm the bad guy in your love story, huh? Such childish bullcrap. What the fick? Keith, don't worry. I'm totally fine. But I don't get it. Why are you holding a knife? With freaking blood? Stupid brat. I was preparing steak for dinner. Bonk. Then you started screaming like an idiot. I had to go up there to check what was going on. Turned out it was just you shouting for your favorite doll. Uh, shut up. Barbie is not a doll. Then what is Barbie exactly to you? Your BF? Keith? Never mind. Just don't ficking say like he's a damn toy. Look, I believe there's some misunderstanding here. Barbie is not a doll. Yes. Not your belonging either. Yes. Let me tell you something. He's my son now. The fuck? Mr. Wilson? I don't think it's a good idea to tell Keith this early. Barbie? What are you talking about? Mr. Wilson has treated me with care. He asked if I could call him daddy. And I said, okay. What the fick? Are you nuts, crazy old man? Ugh, this stupid brat won't understand. Barbie, that's why he will never be my son. Daddy chill. Hey, Barbie dear. Did he threaten you? Did he hit on your head? Keith, I told you, I was fine. Please tell me the truth. He's not gonna hurt you. While I'm here. Are you crying? Nope. You're shaking. No, I'm not. Hey, it's gonna be all right. You have to trust me. He didn't hurt me. Yeah? Yeah. What if... Now, now, Keith. Your eyes are red. Fine, I was crying. Here. This may calm you down. You feel better now? Thanks, Barbie. Have we all done yet? Shut up, old man. Good. Dinner's ready. Yay. By the way, Barbie, my son, could you help me get that stinky brat to shower? That smell is ruining my steak. What the fick, old man you wanna? Right away, Dad. Hey, hey, Barbie. Stop pushing me. I'm not done with that man yet. Keith, please calm down. You need to control your anger. Oh, so now you're on his side? No, you got that wrong. I'm not taking any side. I just want to see you and your dad get on well each other. For real? Yeah. Me and that stupid man? Yeah. I'd rather bleach my brain. Your dad has told me everything. He said... Wait, what are you... Shush. Only this will make you stop, talking about him. But, please, hear me out. Keith, I can't breathe. I'm sorry, Barbie. You've said enough. Keith, please. I'm sorry. I have no other choice. You're insane. Let me go. No. I said let me go. And I said no. You forgot what your dad had told you? Excuse me? You probably didn't get it. What do you mean? He said, go get me to shower. Huh? You still don't get it? No, I still... Oh. So you've got it. Keith, I don't think this is perfect time for it. Then when? I smell horrible now. And I need a shower. Will you help me? But, but... Will you obey his order? Keith, please. Please, don't treat me like a toy. Didn't you allow that old man to do so? No, of course not. I would never let him do that. And he would never do that to me. I get it. If so, will you obey my order? Keith! Wasn't your life made all for me? Please don't. Get me to shower, now. Yes, sir. Good. I love you a lot. You have to promise me that you'll stay away from that freak old man. Please. He's planning on something. I swear to God. Barbie, 
How can I help you, sir? Barbie, are you okay? I'm perfectly fine. How can I help you, sir? I don't really like the way you're saying. Speak normal to me, Pless. I can't. I'm your toy, remember? Fick. Barbie, you're getting it all wrong. I didn't mean to offend you. Please, I'm sorry. Here. You feel anything? No. Come on. It's damn hard right now. Please, say it. If that's in order, it's hard, sir. Damn it. Barbie, son, what took you so long? The food gets cold. Right away, sir. We'll be there just a few minutes. No. Dad calls us. Let's get this thing quick. Fine. If that's what you want. There you are, my son. Whoa, a medium rare steak. It smells so good, Dad. Glad you like it. It looks fine. Shut up, brat. Sit down and eat. Fine. Let me see who... Just enjoy your steak. Someone will do that for you. Do I have to make myself clear? Damn. It just give me a sec, will you? Whoa. Are we having a party now? Sure. We are. Thanks for inviting us, pal. Huh? When did I say that? Thanks, Mr. Wilson. It's kind of you to let us stay and enjoy this meal. Oh my god, the steak is the goat. It's the beef. Lol, well, I mean, this steak is the greatest of all time. Oh, okay. But still, it's the beef. Okay, okay, so... What's going on? Hey, since we're having champagne now, let's cheer to celebrate. Aren't you listening to me, Barbie? Barbie, huh? His name sounds like a girl. Cool name. Thanks. I'm Mia. Nice to meet you. And I'm Dan. Are you Keith's stepbrother? Say less, bro. It's not funny. Cousin? Just stop. All right, last try. Stepmother? Are you ficking for real? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. I'm Keith Stahl. Um... Don't get it, but cool nickname still. Thanks a lot. Anyway, shall we cheer? Barbie, come talk to me outside. Oh no, you won't. Barbie? Like what Dad said. Okay, you know what? I'm taking you by myself. Hey, put me down. Put me down. Keith is totally gay. For real? So gay. Ugh, what are you doing? Is this party all you're doing? No. Please be honest. I said no. Barbie? Oh my god, can you stop? I'm asking you the last time. Okay, fine, it's me. So what? That's what I thought. Why? Why what? Why you did that? Beat me. Barbie. All right, just stop looking at me like that. Good. Then tell me now. You're in a hard time. Your family is broken. Your beloved sister has left. You got nothing left. But I have you now. I told you, Keith. I'm just a doll. Nothing more. Fick it. I don't care. Look, you need more than just my existence. What you really need right now is, is being loved, Keith. Being loved? I don't need that. I just want to protect you. And that makes me happy. Silly Keith. You still don't get it. What? You, you need your friends. I got you. All right. You also need your dad. Oh, crap. Just listen to me. You're broken. I know you are. Could you just stop? No, and I won't stop. And I would never... I'll fight for you. And I'll be there for you. I'm gonna go inside now. Wait. Barbie. Please don't leave me. I won't. Please kiss me now. Now? Yes. You sure? Make me... Oh my god, Keith. So you gay now? Elio, what are you doing here? Didn't you invite me to the party? You sent me a MSG. Look, 
Barbie. Huh? Did you? No. Tell the truth. Fine, I did that. Um, what was that for? For being honest with me. Oh. Oh? Haha, <laughs> never mind. You're handsome. Um, do I need to say anything? Just shut up. Okay. I'm going home. Finally. Wait, please come in. So, am I allowed to join or not? Nope. Yes. Steak is ready for you. Cool. Ouch. What was that for? You're rude. He's our guest. Not mine. Hey, hey, okay, okay. Jeez, Barbie. Good. Please be nice to your friends. Nah, I'm good. Okay, okay, fine. Gosh, since when did you get that scary? I learned from my boyfriend. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. Wait, did you call me your... Ooh, they're having champagne. Let's go inside. Hey, we're not done talking yet. Hey, we're back. Whoa. Um, are we going to talk about that? You'll get used to it. Trust me. Keith! Hey. What did you call me? I didn't say anything. I did say something. I did say. You're my boyfriend. There we go. I love you. And I love you too. Oh, um... You look cute when you blush. Thanks, um... What's wrong? No, it's nothing. Tell me. It's just, oh, your heart again. Sorry. Gosh, it's getting harder. Oops, it didn't listen. Keith, I don't think it's gonna work. What's not gonna work? This... this whole thing between us. I don't see any problem. You still don't understand. Then explain. I'm listening. It's just... We can't be together. You're speaking nonsense. Why did you say that? Well... The thing is... I'm not real. What do you mean? You're here with me now. Why would you say you're not real? As I've said... You still don't understand. Then Ficking explain to me. Please, don't swear on me. I'm sorry. I couldn't control my anger. My whole life was made... for you. You keep saying that. Then you got what it means. Yeah. You're mine for good, aren't you? Physically, um, yes. But seems you miss one thing. And what is it? Mentally... Huh? My whole life was made... to calm your anger... to make you feel love. And to teach e e you to care for the others. I told you. It doesn't matter to me. It will... Just why? If you keep racking with anger, I'll disappear forever. Disappear? You're kidding. Do I look like I'm kidding, Keith? But what kind of sorcery is that? Isn't my existence a magic to this world? Of course. Your existence is also a miracle to me. You're my happiest dream. Funny. I didn't expect we could end up loving each other like this. Yeah. Even though I'm a doll. Say less, Barbie. I love you. No matter who you are. Or what you are. Even I'm a doll? Even you're a doll. My Barbie. Stop drinking, Dan. You're damn wasted. I'm just tipsy, lol. Don't worry. Um, um, that's what I thought. Look, anyway, where are those two? They literally been up there for 30 minutes. What was that? Earthquake! Mr. Wilson. Chill, lax, kids. It's just those two boys. That loud? We should take a look. They might need our help. Okay. I'd rather not, if I were you. Why? Never mind. Go see for yourself. I got what you mean. Elio, can you check them out? Huh? Just me? What's wrong? On second thought, I haven't finished my steak. Fine. I'm going... Good luck. Then... Oh my god. Elio told me everything. You're so gay. Fick it. Language. Keith. 
since when you fell for him, bro. Could you please get out? Come on. I'm your bestie. How did you first meet? This is not the right time, Mia. We first met in Keith's dream. Really? Barbie? Really? Keith's dream? No shit, dude? I'm telling the truth. We even kissed. Okay, that's it. Get out. Jeez. What a hot-headed guy. Okay, now I should go. A few moments later. There you are, lovebirds. Are you all done yet? Never enough. My lips are numb. Whoa. Thanks, Keith. That helps. Really? Right in front of my steak? Okay, it's late now. I better go home. Should be earlier. Ugh, you're nuts! I'll take that as a compliment. Bruh? Here. I will go see you off. No, it's fine. Just sit. Thanks for the dinner, Mr. Wilson. My pleasure. Glad you enjoy it. Goodbye, Elio. See you tomorrow. See ya. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Earthquake! That's my phone. Oh. Just feel free. I'm leaving for a sec. Okay, Dad. Sweet. Your dad's not here now? Let's get to work. What work? I'm not asking you. What work? Ugh. Isn't it too obvious? It's you guys. Slay! Slay! Please don't say that word again. Anyway, as our best friend, you need to tell us everything, Keith. Yeah, though I have no idea what we're talking about right now. We have nothing to tell you. Barbie, tell us, would you? Like, everything? Yes, every everything. Every, 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 every... Shut up, bro. Fine. We should tell her, Keith. She's your friend. Even so, I'm not telling her. What's the point? Do you want me to tell Barbie your dark secret? Oh dear. The foot girl? Only that will make you spit it all out. Wow, I didn't know Keith have a secret. Hey, what is it supposed to mean? Chop chop, before your dad comes back here. Fine, listen. Sound like a Disney fairy tale to me. For real. Barbie, is it true? That you're a... Yep. I'm a doll. Told you. Whoa, but that's insane. Cool stuff. But how? Beat me. All I just know. Barbie is my little sis doll. Can you ask her where to buy the same doll? I want to have my own Barbie. Bro, get some help. Seek a lullaby. Is everything good? Oh, Mr. Wilson, you're back. Anyway, it's late now. My mom just called me. No, she didn't. Shut up, bro. We're leaving now. Goodbye, sir. Hey, I haven't finished my steak. Oh my gosh. Weird kids. Did you shoo your friends off, brat? Nope. Okay. Anyway, remember to clean these up. Dang it. I'll do it. No. You stay here. I need you a favor. Um... Don't worry, Barbie. These things are just a piece of cake. Okay. <laughs> okay. Are you ready? She's coming in no time. She? Who's she? Dad. Go see for yourself. Um... Yes, Dad. Um... Hello, Barbie dear. Who are you? How do you know my name? You don't know me, but I do know you. Huh? You can call me Mrs. Wilson. Evelyn Wilson. Or you can call me your mom, I guess. My mom? But I'm just a doll. How can I have a mom? There you are, baby. I've been waiting for you. What's going on here? Keith! You little brat, come here. Come meet your new mother. Keith's stepmom. And my mom... Wait! What do you want, old man? 
Say hi to her. Okay. Who's this bitch? Watch your manner. What the actual- Keith, that's enough. Please, calm down. Well, well, you got two kids. With kinda unique characters here. <laughs> Lucky me. Hope so. Shut up. Okay. Are we done yet? I still got some dishes to break. You know what? Just fick off and do your thing. With my pleasure. Um. I'm sorry for this inconvenience, babe. He's just a little brat. No, it's fine. I start to like him already. What's his name? He's Keith. Oh my. And we have a really cute boy here. What's your name, darling? Huh? Go on. She's asking you. But didn't you say you already knew me before? Oh? No, I said nothing. Why do you think so? You're lying. Are you evil witch? Language. What are you thinking? Son, I can't believe you said that to my new wife. But, but, she said she knew me. I swear. I hadn't told her anything earlier. She already called my name Barbie. So you must be Barbie. Barbie, dear. You seem a bit worn out. How about you taking a little rest? We'll talk about this tomorrow. Thanks, uh, but no. I'm perfectly fine. Um, I don't feel so good. D just, Keith, please help. Son, son, are you all right? Oh my God, somebody please help. What's going on here? What the actual Barbie? What have you all done to Barbie? Move. <laughs> Barbie, can you hear me? Barbie? No. No, 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 no. Barbie, my son, what, what happened? What the fick, old man? What have you done to my Barbie? The fick are you talking about? I didn't do anything. He suddenly blacked out while talking with your mom. I'm sorry, who's my mom again? I am. Nah, you're his bitch. Oh my, I swear to God, I'm gonna- What you gonna do then? You wanna beat me up? Or save Barbie now? Uh. That's what I thought. Just shut up and find a way to save him. Damn, you spoiled brat. Knock it off. You should stop fighting. Just because of a doll. Just because of a doll? Are you ficking for real right now? Hey, hey, don't you dare to lay a hand on her. Say, woman, what have you done to him? You're speaking nonsense. Why would I have to do that? Spit it all out. I know you did. You poor child. I pity you. Are you always like that? When talking with your ex, mom? Dafuk? Is that why your mom and your little sister left? None of your business. And you know what? You smell like ass and cheese together. Fick off. Barbie, please say something. I know you can hear me. Son? Screw you. I'm not your son. All right. As you wish. Hey, little brat. Oh my god, how did you... The door was damn locked. Indeed it was. But I broke it. Oops. Just what are you? I'm Evelyn Wilson. Not that. What are you? A woman? That helps. Your mom. Thanks, but no. A witch? Okay, so wait, what? A witch? What the hell? Silly boy, Keith. You're still so naive. Quit saying dumb shit. And get to the point. Fine. As you wish. Oh shit. What the actual- How is it? Is it the first time you see magic? Let go of me, you evil witch. Make me. I said. Let go of me. Not enough. ISTG, if you don't put me down, I will- Okay. Ugh. Just what do you want from me? Isn't it obvious? I want you to stay away from your father. Yeah, I wish. Do as you wish. And get the hell out of this place. Whoa, whoa, hold on, woman. Did you mean I need to move out of my own house? Precisely. 
Are you stupid? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. What if I could save your boyfriend? Barbie? Surprise. So it was you all the time. Oops. You've made him suffer. Oh, dear. You've killed him. Oh, no. Actually, Siki, let me tell you this. It's me who gave birth to him. Dafuk? He was made, all thanks to my magic. Didn't he tell you? He's just a doll. He's my fucking boyfriend. Yeah, whatever. Look at that tiny little doll. Except the truth, Keith. You're just a pathetic boy. So craving for love. They'd even fall in love with a doll for girls. Just shut up. Uh. Oh my god, please save him. I'll do whatever you want. Anything? Anything. Pack your things. It's about time to get out. Right after you bring him back. Oh. Where am I? Barbie? Barbie? You're awake. Oh, Keith. Your lips. I can feel it. What do you mean? Keith, I can feel your lips. Wait. So you couldn't feel it all the time? Yes, but how? What have you done? Let me try it again. They're so warm. Yeah? And soft. Uh, huh? And... Okay, knock it off. It's me doing some little extra magic. So that Barbie can be a human. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Mrs. Wait, it's you. The woman last night. It's rude. To call your mom like that. Hold on. Now, that Barbie is a human? So that means... I have my tiny hole. Yes. Oh, crap. Just get out! Barbie, we need to go. To where? I don't know. Just follow me. Let's get the hell out of this house. Okay. Now what, Keith? Let me call Mia and Dan. They might have a room for us. Keith, it's late. Sorry, but do you have any room left? We got kicked out of the house. Oh boy. So? Sorry, my parents at home. How about asking Dan? Nope. Shut up, Dan. You're supposed to let them call you first. Oops. Anyway, see you later. So sorry for not helping you much. Okay. So? We're screwed. Oh dear. What should we do now? Don't worry. I got an idea. And what is it? Well... Are you serious? Nope. All right. You can stay here. Thanks. On one condition. Sure. What is it? You can't make out here. The heck can't we? Hey, Keith, chill. So? Sure, Elio. Uh, thanks for letting us stay. Okay. Actually, if you want to make out, let's do three. I'd rather oof myself. Uh, fine. Your friend is nice. I'll take that annoying. I think he likes you. Let's just hope not. Come on. You're the prince, charming after all. Yeah? Facts. No printer. If I'm the prince, then you're my gorgeous little princess. Whoa, someone please help. You can't run. Because you're mine. Gosh, your pants are wet again. Let's see. What I'm going to eat first. How about your soft and smooth lips? Oh. It's so damn sweet. Um, you like it? Of course. I like everything about you. First your lips. Now let's see. How about some dessert? Dessert? It's your cake. Daddy chill. Can I join? <coughs> Get out. Fine. Then no make out. Uh, what are you? Our boss? Actually, you're staying at my house. Okay. So what? Keith. A no is a no. You are not allowed to do that here. We're sorry. We won't do that again. Good boy. Then I shall leave now. We were totally busted. I think we should stop. Let's call it a day, Keith. Nope. We're just getting started. Keith. Elio might hear us again. Then I will do it slowly. <laughs> 
Geez, chill, lax, dude. What did I tell you? No makeout. And you still did. I was just lying on top of Barbie. Like what Keith said. Like I'm gonna buy that shit. Goodbye. What now? We're totally screwed. Maybe we should go back home? We can ask our dad. Absolutely not. Why? Didn't you see what that woman has done to you? You mean my mom? I'd rather not call her your mom. She will cast her spell on you again. Going to see her is like walking into the deadly flame. But we can't keep wandering around like this. You need a home. Somewhere to return. Just give me some time. I'll figure it out. Are you... Shaking? I'm not... You're scared. Who told you that? I know you better than anyone. Only you know, huh? Yeah, I'm freaked out. A bit. Whoa, hey Keith. The Keith I know was fearless. The Keith I know would come back home, kick that woman's ass out of our house. But that woman is a witch. She will put you in danger. I'm scared of losing you again. Don't worry. You won't lose me this time. As long as you're with me, I'm not going anywhere. You still don't get it. Yeah, yeah, she's a witch. But she's my mom too. I'm not scared of her. Fine. Then we're going home. Yay. Whoa, wait. Are you just gonna hit there without a plan? I do have a plan. Which is... Let's jump right in and punch that woman in the face. Wow, you're a genius. Thanks, babe. I was being sarcastic. Oh. She's a witch. Hello? Oh. Okay, I got another plan. Okay, then tell me. Here. Barbie, what are you doing here? I'm coming to see you. Is Mrs. Evelyn at home? She's still sleeping upstairs. Why are you asking about her? It's nothing. I just want to talk with you alone. Just make it quick. She could be awake any time. Okay. So, do you happen to notice anything strange about Mrs. Evelyn? No. Not really. Not really? So there is something... I didn't mean that. Please tell me, Dad. Your info might help. Well, fine. I did notice. Her hand glowed sometimes. Glow? Like magic? Magic? Nah, I don't buy those fairy tales. Can you tell me more? Well, she snaps her finger all the time. Snap? That's weird. Don't know. What it's for? Probably just her random thing. <laughs> As expected. There's something wrong with her hand. I must check her whereabouts. Damn the old man's smell. It's damn like cheese. In the ass. Huh. Something there. A ring. Cool stuff. This will come in handy. Should be enough for Barbie and me. To stay around for a couple of months. Anyway, let's check her hand. Nothing strange. Ugh, this is going nowhere. Damn it. The old man is coming near. I must run now. Ready? How do you kill what's already dead? Have you found anything? Nope. But got her ring. We can sell it for money. Um, it looks familiar. Can you hand over me the ring for a few sec? Sure. Actually, it's yours now. Um... Barbie, what's going on? I don't know. I feel strange. Throw it away, Barbie. I can't. What? What the fick? It won't come out. Damn it. Keith. Barbie? Wait, Barbie? 
Yes, it's me. Whoa, you look drop-dead gorgeous. Thanks, darling. Are those fairy wings? I thought you were a doll. I've remembered everything, Keith. My true name is Barbarine. The fairy from the deep wood. That witch Evelyn has stolen my magic ring. And she used the ring to make me lose every memory. Damn. Not only that, she turned me into a doll and named me Barbie. So that's why... But how can you get back to normal after being turned into a doll? Did you forget? You hugged me real tight when I was just a tiny doll. Love can cure any spells. I get it. We had a real hot night back then. It's not the time to think about it, Keith. Anyway, it seems that your dad is also manipulated. We have to help him. Can we just pass and leave this place? I don't give a shit about that old man. Keith, trust me. Your dad wasn't like this. He really needs our help. Yeah, right. He needs his chick more than his damn son. Please, we're his only hope. Uh, fine. I'll just do this for you, not for him, all right? Okay. What now? Huh? What are you doing here, little brat? I want to talk. Really? After all that happened, you want to talk? So what? You want me to punch in your face so bad? Still the little brat like the old days. You never change. The only thing I want to change is my father... You little piece of... What's going on here? Will you two just be quiet? I was trying to sleep. There you are, stepmom. Watch your mouth. I've been waiting for you. Ugh, it's you again. You never learn your lesson, huh? Actually, I did. That's why I'm here. To show you something cool. You're wasting our time. I don't think there's no point for us to watch your little show, kiddo. Are you really sure about that? Miss me, Evelyn? BB Barbie, how did you? First of all, it's Barbarine. Second of all, yeah, I've got my ring back. My ring, my ring. Surrender now. You've already lost your magic. What's going here? Dad, I will explain later. No, please. I will do anything for you. Just don't put me back in that filthy place. You have no choice, a woman. Your time has ended now. So long. No, wait. <laughs> Whoa, did you just... Yep. I've banished her back to the Forgotten Land. Old man, so now you're dead? Good. Keith, don't say such thing. Let me check on him. As expected, he was being manipulated. Don't care. I'll put my hand here, and the curse will be cured. <sighs> Where am I? In your dream. Keith, my son. Thank God you're here. Hold on. What did you just call me? My son. Huh? Is there any problem? What the fick is going on in your head? You're high, old man. Wake up. Keith, he has been manipulated for years. The man you're looking at is your real father? You're joking. Son, I love you. Please shut up. That's enough, babe. Be nice to your father. But, but that's impossible. How could he? I'm sorry. I'm really confused right now. It's going to be okay. What you two need is time and a good rest. Can you carry me back into the house? It's cold out here. Can't you just walk? Keith. Yeah. Whatever. How was he? Safe and sound. And strange. And a bit stinky. He needs time to recover. It won't be for long. You said... Old man has been manipulated for years, so all the time, he was grumpy and brutal. Was that what the curse did? Yes. Although the curse was strong, I saw something when I cured him back then. Deep down in his heart, you're there. Ugh, old man. Anyway, can we return to our room? I'm beat. Barbie? Hey, Barbie. The next morning. Oh, good morning, Keith. Hey, Barbie. You're awake, thank God. Did I pass out? Yep. You made me worry sick. Sorry. Transforming into a fairy got me exhausted. I'm here with you now. I'm so happy. We finally have a happy ending. Kids, breakfast is ready. Yes, Dad. Oh, 
We have guests in 30 minutes. So make haste, all right? Got it, old man. Cool, we got 30 minutes. What do you mean? I mean this... <coughs> oh... So, where's our guest? They might be here soon. There they are. I'll go get them. Big bro. Clara, Mom, you're back. Welcome home. Oh my, we have a new guest here. Good morning, Mrs. Wilson. My name is Barbie. I'm Keith's friend. Actually, Barbie is my boyfriend. Ooh. Wow, my brother is gay. I love it. I'm happy for you too. Thanks, Mom. I love you both. I love you too. And I love all of us. Especially you, Keith. Yeah, I love you. Thanks for being mine, Barbie. Thanks for loving me, Keith. One second. Whoa, what are you doing, Keith? Mom, Dad, little sis. You guys just enjoy the breakfast down here. Won't you eat anything? I have my own breakfast now. Uh, oh. Um, what are they eating, Dad? Sausage, I guess. I want to eat sausage, too. <laughs> Let's save it for now, dear. What a couple of lovebirds. Yeah, I miss our old days. Want to bring back the old time? Sure. Clara, darling, you go watch some Coco Melon. Mom and Dad need to clean our room. Oh, okay. Yay, Coco Melon. Come on, Keith. We just did it 30 minutes ago. I didn't say anything. I'm not taking you up here to do that hot thing again. Oh. You're really cute, Barbie. I want to kiss you. Yeah. Can I ask you a favor? Uh-huh. I want you to be you. Huh? I want to see your wings. Oh, are you sure? Yeah. You look gorgeous when you're a true fairy. Okay. That's my boy. Dear Barbarine, I love you.